Well, that was outside the convention center in Philadelphia yesterday. Inside, it was pretty much the same thing. You see a sign there for Never Hillary, plenty of Bernie signs. Whenever Hillary's name was mentioned, at least in the early part of the session yesterday, there were loud boos from Bernie supporters. A very much divided convention. Democrat strategist and Bernie supporter Chuck Roker is with us now. He's always got a smile on his face, but you know, Chuck, you were betrayed. You worked hard for Bernie Sanders, and the Democrat Party undermined him consistently and forced him out. Are you going to boo tonight when Bill Clinton appears? No, I'm not going to boo. I don't want Donald Trump to be the president, but it was an emotional roller coaster last yeah. night. And you're right, Barney. You know, did the party own the up and up with everything that we did in this convention? I was on this campaign for over a year, right? And there's a lot of our supporters here are very passionate about this convention, about the platform, and about the things that we've built with this revolution. So it was an emotional roller coaster. Not everybody will be on uh, the Hillary train, but you're going to see some of the outliers and some of the people who are just never going to be with her, and it'll be interesting on what happens tonight. Well, it's, look, I mean, for once in my life, I feel for you, Chuck. I really do, because you put a lot of hard work <laughs> into Bernie Sanders' campaign. I mean, you really did. I don't think this anger is over. I mean, day one of the convention is over. Okay, say goodbye to it. But day two, three, and four, still to come, I think you guys are still going to make yourselves very well loudly heard, I think. Well, I think that it's hard to bring a really fast-moving train to a stop on a dime. And I don't know how it stops or where it stops, but we built something. We built a movement. And I think the majority of that movement will go with Hillary and her team. But I think there's parts of this movement who will continue on through their local politics, through their local parties, make sure that their issues are heard all across the country. Because I think Bernie Sanders changed the way that we do politics on the Democratic side. I also think he had a huge impact on Democrats and their policy going forward. You pulled them way to the left. Bernie Sanders and Elizabeth Warren together have produced what I think is a socialist party. The Democrats are a socialist party. Now, you're not going to disagree with me, are you? I'm going to say that we're for clean water and clean air and trying to make sure every worker has a right. If that's being a socialist, count me in. But we want to make sure that people have a voice. Well, spend a lot more government money, uh, keep the, all the banks and private enterprise tightly regulated, tax the rich, and forget about the deficit. I call that socialism. I call that European socialism. What do you say? Well, I think that the Democratic Party is a big ten. I don't think anybody here at the Democratic Party is waving socialist signs. I understand all the things that you said, Barney, on the taxation. As you know, we've talked about this. I own a small business. It's an LLC. I get taxed very heavily as an individual. If I was to make a little bit of money, I think we should be giving small businesses like mine a bigger break so we could help put more money into our economy. You know, Chuck, you're already come on over to the other side. Come on over to the side that says <laughs> private enterprise, growth. Let's get this economy going. On, on that would leash. be a headline, wouldn't great engine of growth, which is American capitalism. There's room for you on this side of the fence as well, you know, Chuck. What a headline that would be. Varney gets socialist Chuck Roach to come over to the Republican <laughs> side and become a capitalist. Here we go. Now we'd have some ratings. I could live with that. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Chuck, you're a good man, and we appreciate you being Thank with you, us. Thank you, Varney. Thank you, sir. Thanks for having yes. us. Yes, sir.